of the issues was the uh the little notches so you can see the notch that's uh right there is sitting in there which is cool but the one over here I was trying to figure out if it was gonna at least let me see if I can get y'all a good angle. If it was gonna like that, I ain't gonna lie to you. And then the military hit me. <laughs> That's why I keep on taking off this wrap. But uh so we're gonna clean up the garage and then we're gonna put the grill on the ram. Yes. The grill on the ram. Yes, I do have a new grill. Remember the the bill from 22, I have to complete the ram RT. I'm trying to debate if I'm going to go air suspension. what's going on guys this you got serious mindset and we are back with a new video hey if you're new to the channel first and foremost please hit that subscribe button everybody else hit that like button make sure you drop that fire emoji right after why so serious i greatly appreciate it by the way you have to type why so serious er and then fire emoji or something like that but anyway um there's going to be a lot of stuff going on in this video uh for everyone that's been putting comments about man keep the rap keep the rap keep the rap man it's dope i don't even think y'all seen that at, uh on top as well so i got like you see all these little ribbons look at all that look at all that see that's one thing about black you can see everything in black look at that that's crazy but anyway so we have a couple of little things that i ordered for the wide body as well look take a look at that you know why so serious so i did order some new uh pin stripping because because see this right here look at that see look at all those infrared for watch this see and now it just stays down so i don't know if it's because i tried to wrap it um behind that that actual seal i don't know um so the game plan is to potentially uh keep the wrap Work on the front, work on the back, and see, look, look at this, look. I can just point out a whole bunch of stuff, look at that. Now this is me, this is me and my work. So if if I can do it to somebody else, then I can do it to myself as well. So I'm not exempt from doing work and it's looking like garbage. All right, so, ooh, so let's go ahead and get going. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Ooh, we got batteries, the light is on, you see the light is on. Y'all already know what's about to go down. We're about to do that cold start. So let's go ahead and do that cold start. All right, let's see what that cold start is. So. Okay, I thought that light came on. Okay, because I was about to say, man, we should be all charged up. Should be all charged up. We should be all charged up. All right, so today we are gonna be working on the round, but I have to do some running around. Uh, if you guys are maybe seeing this, it's probably New Year's Eve, so um, if I don't put out a video by what? New Year's Day, Happy New Year's anyway. Happy early New Year's. Anyway, stay safe, stay motivated. Let me go ahead and get going, and then uh, we're gonna turn on the camera and talk a little bit more. They never knew. All right, so. Like I said uh, before I got in the car, I am ordering some new uh, pinstripes because I'm trying to figure out a way where they can actually sit out if I was to stay with this wrap. So I appreciate everybody and their feedback as far as, man, keep it, man, keep it, keep it, turn that music down. You know, I'm trying to get my monetization up, trying to get some change since I uh, lost some money in this wrap. But anyway, <laughs> what's so serious? Urgh. 
but um so reordered the uh the stripping um the pin stripping and um i guess so that black satin is uh vivid that's vivid wraps uh brand or whatnot so I hear that thing. Whew. It'll get you in a lot of trouble. You hear me? But anyway, so that black satin is Vivid's uh, satin wrap. Now I heard Vivid is not a was well, not it's not all that good. So what I'm thinking about is actually doing um uh what what did what did he say? He told me um. I think I'm scraping something else. I feel like I'm scraping something else. There's always something wrong. I'm gonna have to pull over and figure out what the heck I'm scraping. But uh, I heard that uh, Avery is the satin wrap to, to, not really satin wrap, man, hold on. I keep on hearing something. Every time I hear something, I feel like, let me see. How you doing, brother? Ah, uh, let's see. Oh, that's what it is, okay. So y'all see? That's where uh, water is supposed to come out. So that's what's actually scraping. That right there. So what we gotta do, I'm telling you, it's always something with this car, right? So what I need to do is, I got all that slack and we don't want, yeah. So I'm gonna have to cut that off then. Cause we want, we want the water to come out, but I don't wanna lose that. I might have to just deal with that and just cut it off. Yeah. <sighs> Yeah, this is the bag life problem. See, when you have bags, it's not all peaches and cream. When you know you riding in it, if, if it's your daily, if it's your daily, bless your heart. But um, but yeah. So since I actually put my uh, since I actually put my air suspension air suspension system inside my wide body i know what's going on with it right so that's the good thing about you know when you install your own stuff you get a chance to depict what's going on right <laughs> between that and youtube right but look check this out though so order the stripping let me continue order the stripping and then i guess i'm gonna order some avery satin black and then i will attempt to <laughs> try this again with no guarantee that this is going that it's not gonna stay so I'm gonna take everybody advice, you know, my wife included, you know what I mean? I worked so hard, you know, I, I, I did what I did, right? So we're gonna go ahead and uh, get ready for that mentally again, but it should be, I don't know, right, let me quit. But anyway, we're gonna put the, uh, the RAM is actually gonna get worked on today between the garage and the RAM. If I don't do it today, it's gonna be done tomorrow. But uh, I'm gonna clean out the garage cause I have, ADD as far as my garage. I can't I can't stand seeing other people garage you passing. They got oh my god. I used to be like that. I ain't gonna lie to you. And then the military hit me. <laughs> That's why I keep on taking off this wrap. But uh so we're gonna clean up the garage and then we're gonna put the grill on the ram. Yes. The grill on the ram. Yes, I do have a new grill. Remember the the bill from 22, I have to complete the ram RT. I'm trying to debate if I'm going to go air suspension, meaning air ride into the truck as well, or um, or just do a do a drop down. And uh, shout out to uh, Mopar Jack as well on IG. Follow Mopar Jack. He gave me some gems as far as uh, battery uh, whatnot, and he run that he run that uh, that that green uh, uh, wide body challenger to the ground, man. <laughs> Look, follow follow him on IG. He, he man, that boy is crazy. I'm trying to get him to start a YouTube channel as well. But shout out to him. He gave me some insight on the battery charger uh, along with my guy um, Spooky Six Four or whatnot. So um, I was able to go ahead and just order me some. So when the car is sitting in the garage. Um, you know, it can still it can stay charged if I'm not gonna drive it regularly. Like, you know, like I don't. I, so, truth be told, the car only got 
the car has what focus the car has 11,000 miles 11,000 miles and mine is a 20 2020 so I got it right at the peak of COVID of 20 yep last year and then we're about to go into to the next year golly I barely drove this car so with that being said you know these challenges gonna be something nice these challenges is going to be something nice uh, when they start doing all this EV stuff. So stay tuned for that. And then we also have to go to the dealership because we got to get the software um, in the car or whatnot. So it's going to be a lot of running around. And then I have a... I got so much stuff. Y'all just got to stay tuned. I got so much stuff. What y'all think that is? Put in, drop in the comments what y'all think that is. But anyway, stay tuned. I appreciate you guys for watching and gals for watching. Uh, stay motivated, stay serious. Uh, let's see what happens. Why so serious? Er. All right, guys, so made it back to the house. As you see, the garage is all distraught. Look, if your garage, hold on, I'm not one to tell you about your life, but you got these fancy, nice cars if you're watching this, so you're about to step your game up or whatnot. Organize your garage. Just organize it. Just organize it. It's supposed to be your domain where you take pride in whatever you build, whatever you do, or whatever you what whatever you want to do. What's so serious? Sir? I'm not one to tell you what to do. But anyway, you know, I'm pretty sure you probably one of those individuals. Drop in the comments if you're one of those individuals that drive around people's neighborhoods. You be like, oh lord, they are harder. I'm just saying. Mm -mm -mm. But stay tuned, guys. So we're gonna go ahead and get this thing going. I don't know if I will have enough time to uh, work on the Ram for the grill because I, I was out long enough. So we're gonna go ahead and fast motion this uh, and take care of all this. Look at all this, look at all this, look at all this, sheesh. So I already got a head start. That's my head start right there. <laughs> You know, brush my teeth though. Watch some serious Urgh. What's going on guys? This is the next day. Um, I felt like I wanted to get this done since this was an off day for me and I didn't get a chance to get to the ram. So we're gonna pull up the ram. We're gonna go ahead and work on this grill. Uh, I'm gonna show y'all this grill. I'm excited. Make sure you shop at summerapparel.net. Get you a nice serious mindset hat. Tangerine series, which is limited with the suede, with the, with the good old H-Town. And then it has, it's got a couple little things on it. Hold on, let me, let me show y'all. Let me put y'all on game. So we got the Thunderbolt, the trademark Thunderbolt. We got the right, the, the rocket in the back. And then you, of course, you got the H-Town State if it focus. And then, you know, we serious mindset. This is the Stroll series. So with the actual serious mindset in the brim, like I said, all of my items are quality made products this is not something that you can just buy at the corner store and say hey let me slap this on there we ain't going that route we're gonna make everything official so like i said as i grow this brand help me grow the brand i appreciate everybody that's been supporting that's been uh rocking with me since day one. Oh my god unbelievable i wouldn't have not imagined it but anything is possible but we're gonna try to make sure that we grow for 22 going into the year or whatnot so a lot of changes coming the ram bill will be one of my main focus for 22 because i just see a lot of i just i'm, I'm just falling in love with my ram seeing all these two-door ram bills is like it's 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 real magical so um the garage is somewhat swept from last night um now what i'm gonna have to do is pull out the uh the wide body um and move the ram into the garage so i can work on work on that grill so i want to show y'all this grill this grill is it's, it's nice it's nice so let's go ahead i'm a little bit I'm a little bit toned down because you know it's new years you know i ain't turning up yet you gotta hold hold it and get turned up hold it and get turned up but uh stay tuned guys i appreciate you guys for watching make sure you hit the subscribe button uh so let me go ahead and move all these cars <laughs> stay serious all right guys so ram is right there in the back as you see now up here is the uh the grill i've been storing it like i said i got so many gems but i've been storing it up here see if i can one hand this thing see if i can one hand this thing 
Well, this thing is long, long, big paws. Oh shoot, working with a monster, hold on. Oh. Go ahead and knife knife. You already know when it's unboxing, it's knife knife. Ooh, y'all see that thing? Ooh. Rambo, what Rambo? Check that out. Ooh, woo. Man, this is a nice grill. Oh my God, this is nice. And then of course the letter's gonna go right there. So what I'm thinking is, I'm thinking about taking the RT and then putting it somewhere in the corner or whatnot. Cause you know, this is honeycomb. And I think that's kind of the same honeycomb too. Let me see. Uh, it might be the same. I don't know. That's something we're going to have to see. So let me go ahead and get everything going. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram at serious underscore lanes on Instagram. Because I make a lot of different little stories, skits, or daily life episodes. So uh, let me go ahead and get everything. Let me see. I think the letters. I need to find the letters. Because the letters are RAM. And they are, I think it's like a matte. Yeah, it's like a matte. It's not glossy, like a satin type. Yeah, cause this is satin. So yeah, this is satin. That's satin, that's, that's like a matte. Yeah, it's like a matte. I don't know, we might go have to go matte on this. Woo, I'm telling you, this rim truck, hey, I'm, I'm capping right now, but when I do it, cause it takes me time, but I, I got a vision for it. I, I do have a vision as y'all see with the wide body. So I just got to make sure that the vision looks decent and not look like trash. <laughs> All right, guys. But uh, stay tuned while we uh, go ahead and start working on the round. All right. So I wanted to go over a small little overview when you're taking off the grill um, or getting to the grill. Or if you're going for the headlights, right? So if anybody's seen my video of uh, me placing the headlights, it's the same setup or whatnot. Man, these, these jokers are nice. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> but anyway, uh, you go ahead and you take off the front cover here. So you will have to pop up these bad boys. So you better get your, uh, your actual, what is it? Your lifting tool, whatever. <laughs> and then now, what we're gonna end up doing is uh, taking off all the screws. So you got one, two, um, I'm missing a screw here. <laughs> uh, so yeah, so one, two, three, four. So that's just my basic four and I'm gonna have to get another screw because what we have to do is we have to set up the, hold on, don't scratch it. Hold on, don't scratch yourself, player. So what we're gonna have to do is put in the brackets that they supplied right here, and then I'm putting them inside wherever they have them on here. So I didn't see any directions, but if you're mechanically inclined enough, you should be okay. Should be okay. It's not like you're dealing with a, a BMW or anything. It's just an American truck, American truck, a 2011 American truck, RT round, by the way. But anyway, so yeah, so. We're gonna go ahead and take this off, and then we're gonna go ahead and uh, get ready to fit the attachments to go on here. It should be snip snip. Now, another thing that I wanna tell y'all is make sure, depending on if y'all have a 2011, or I think it's a 2013 or 2013, but there's a slight cut on the higher 
uh, Rams uh, opposed from the 2010s, 2011, I think 2012. So what I'm saying is the bumper actually does like that, which is weird. And I didn't know that as well until I ordered another bumper and it was just trash. But anyway, uh, so we're going to go ahead and take this off and it should be the should be the correct fitting so we we will know we will know so let's go ahead and get going on this and then go from there all right so now grill is off as you see you have uh, i'm just gonna flip it like that so you have right here see that right there they snap in here so that's what that snaps into and everything lines into sure or should line into um so we'll see let's go ahead and do a test fitting doing everything by one hand we're gonna go ahead and do it with one hand let's see oh yeah perfect so i see that perfect look at that look at that so that's what we're gonna be looking like yeah yay and then we got the ambers right there so i'm trying to figure out i think i'm gonna run my ambers with my i think i'm running the ambers with my I want to do it with the fog lights, but I'm tired of putting them on. Mm, I guess it shouldn't matter. I guess it shouldn't matter. So yeah, let me figure out what I'm gonna do with those ambers, cause that's, you see they got, so they got the plugs pre-wired, so they already have everything pre-wired. And then they included, um, they included these. And I like these too, because y'all can see here, they have the wires already pre-stripped, but they're long enough. I think that's what I like about them. They're long enough. So let me go ahead and put everything together. I still haven't found my RAM, my RAM emblems. I don't know where I put them at. They're just somewhere around, because I showed uh, Andrew. Shout out to my guy, Andrew uh, Rango uh, Lock. And then my guy, El Fusio. Make sure you follow him. All right, so we're going to take off this. And then we're gonna put this on the grill as well. We're gonna see if that's gonna fit on there as well. Cause we don't let them know it's an RT, baby. All right, so stay tuned. So I was like, why is this looking like that? So yeah, so that piece actually broke. Oh, this. Yeah, that's the piece that actually snaps into here. Is it there? Yep. Yeah, it's there. And then this piece, I think that goes this notch. I think it's this notch right here. Let me see. Let's see. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. That's exactly how that goes. Dang. Ugh, it's always something. It's always something. So the other side is cool, but this side is not. So. Let me see, I gotta figure that out. All right, let me go ahead and just test fit and see what we got.
all right so i did have a couple of issues with the fitting i mean this is an ebay deal so it came from china or whatnot but i'm gonna show y'all what i'm looking at right so the rim it, it is fitting in so i do give it everything seems to flow as you see here everything seems to flow um the only problem that i did have like i told y'all was the uh let me get a flashlight let me get a flashlight the issues was the uh the little notches so you can see the notch that's uh right there is sitting in there which is cool but the one over here i was trying to figure out if it was gonna at least let me see if i can get y'all a good angle if it was gonna at least um hit into that little clip down there as you see i put in my screws back on here which they actually provide the bracket so you see one two three four brackets um that side snapped in so the right side snapped in so let's give it a pull um seems durable once i screw everything down seems durable so it's very cheap this is cheap of course right so this will be wrapped as well depending on what kind of color scheme i go with the round but um the main reason why i got this not only for the rebel look in the front but also for um for these jokers so for the amber lights so the amber lights will be connected here i just have to figure out where i'm gonna put it i don't know if i'm gonna put a switch which is probably too much um and then i'm gonna order another rt badge because the honeycomb the honeycomb on this ram rebel type grill is different from the honeycomb that's on the rt so i'm just gonna get a flat rt uh deal from amazon i slept that joker on there so at least you know that thing is rt so we can still run you know what i mean it's va baby look at that thing look at that thing look at that thing look at that thing so uh once i connect everything I'm going to turn on the camera and then we're going to close it out. So let me go ahead and get going so we can just go from there. So stay tuned. Stay motivated. Make sure y'all subscribe as well. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button. So let's go ahead and finish this thing up so I can roll. I think I'm going to go to the gym. I'm feeling like, oh, muscle serious. All right, so that's where we are right now. The rim is connected. Now, I didn't. Now, what I didn't do, which was a rookie mistake, was close the hood um, to see how it's going to look. But... I'm somewhat satisfied with it. We're going to go ahead and sprouse it up a little bit more. I'm going to wait on these actual connectors because going through the fuse box, I was trying to figure out where to connect it to. And I have some of these as well that helps with the connection on the fuses. Now, you can see here, I don't have too much real estate. So since I don't have too much real estate, you know, if I put one of these jokers in like right here, it's not going to like you see how you see how the thing just like sits over there and yeah i know i can pull it i can tug it but i don't want to go through that i don't want to go through putting the wires under stress you know when you've been in a electronical or electronics for a while you know that bend radius is uh it, it gets crucial at times so i need to figure out a scenario to uh keep these bad boys on by switch now i will i, I was considering connecting it to my fog lights with the actual led um the actual, the actual led there but i was just like why would i do that i got everything already connected but i might go back and do that still so i don't know i'm just going back and forth but the grill is installed i just need to uh i just need to bolt down all of the uh connections Ooh. Yeah, I just need to bolt down all the connections and then we are good to go. So this is a New Year's Eve video. So happy New Year's again to you guys. Shout out to all my veterans active duty as well. Um, thank you for your service. By the end of the day, guys, make sure you subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, we're about to do some beautiful things to this Ram RT build truck that I've been putting off for years. So now is a great time to do it since I have a little bit more time on my hands. So stay tuned, stay motivated, stay serious. Drop a comment. Let me know what you think about that grill or whatnot. If it's trash, if it's fire, put a fire emoji. But at the end of the day, stay motivated, stay serious. Why so serious? Let's get it, man.